Well, from the business uh, uh, side of uh, philanthropy, when we started Salesforce.com, which was about 13 years ago now, we took 1% uh, of our equity, 1% uh, of our profit, and 1% of all of our employees' time and put it into a 501c3 public charity. That was extremely easy for us because we had no employees, we had no profit, we had no equity. Uh, so, um, <clears throat> however, today, 13 years later, we have about, we'll soon have about 10,000 employees. We um, will do about $3 billion in revenue this year, or over $3 billion in revenue. Uh, and we, because of that, have been able to give away so far uh, over $30 million uh, to a wide variety of nonprofits and NGOs and social entrepreneurs that we work with. We'll give away $100 million over the next five years, additional $100 million. We have, um, we'll deliver 60,000 days of volunteerism and mentorship this year uh, through our employees. And we run about 15,000 nonprofits and NGOs on our cloud services for free. Uh, many of the entrepreneurs and social entrepreneurs uh, that you may know, they run their programs uh, on uh, Salesforce, and we've been fortunate to be able to, to work with many of them. And what I kind of love about this is that it's this concept of really uh, integrated philanthropy that uh, the business and the philanthropy, there is really fundamentally no difference. We have 100 dedicated full-time employees in that foundation now that are doing this work all over the world. And it is a fundamental part of how we run our business. Uh, the first day of employment for uh, each and every one of our employees, in the morning they're doing their orientation, in the afternoon they're doing uh, service.